Okay, well now it's my privilege and pleasure to introduce a really good friend of mine, uh, one of the other authors of Avenue Q, to sing a song for us, Mr. Bobby Corbett. <laughs> This is the show to see. <laughs> okay, so um, back when Jeff and I were writing this show, we had zero idea that it would run on Broadway and off Broadway for 15 years, and none of us really did. Uh, there was one thing we could all agree on, it was that this song I'm about to sing wouldn't. <laughs> and you'll find out why in a moment. Um, <clears throat> so this song, uh, we made a video. We were experimenting with making a television show with Adam Q at first. And I always thought that was a great idea. Um, this song was meant to be sort of a video. And Jeff and I shot this video with the help of some friends. And um, it never really worked when we did it on stage, which is why I'm going to try it. <laughs> um, but uh, so what I'll do is try and just describe the video as as it was made because I I could I could probably have played it, but that would have been too easy. Um, so so it started with a bunch of people going to work and, uh, and a voiceover that said, "Wow, look at all the people! It's amazing." going to different jobs, pursuing different lives. And what's even more amazing is that each of them can be reduced to a single number. Oh, how much do the people in your neighborhood make? After withholding what's their personal take? Wouldn't it be fun to sit and speculate how much your neighbors make each year? song just went on. Oh, how much does an anesthesiologist make for making sure in surgery you're not awake? Does he have a sailboat and a private lake? Or is the Rolex fake? How much does he make? What's your local anesthesiologist worth? And then we had, we didn't know any anesthesiologists. We did know some, some med students. And, uh, we had them dress up in their whites, and we interviewed them on in, in the floor of the med school, and uh, they made up how much they thought an anesthesiologist made, which was like $400,000 or $700,000 a year, and then we cut to me and Jeff, and we're like, oh my god, whoa! And then we just went on. A uh, lawyer has a lot of clients, he's got his bailing down to a science, he might be getting paid real well, but his soul is going straight to of him giving us advice and he was saying you guys better think about uh, copyright infringement because this song sounds too much like uh, who are the people in your neighborhood <laughs> but we just went on with the song <laughs> whether you were a doctor or an actor waiting tables or just another intern printing out a sheet of labels whether you were a teacher or a landlord on the take everyone will judge you by how much But it does. 